All right, we've got one pass that's uh, reasonable today. It's um, at 8.14, 40 seconds AM until uh, 8.21.24 elevation 52.4 and it's going to be coming in I can get to uh, to that screen so it's going to be coming in from the southwest and then uh, I should have uh, the best best chance of getting into it when it's um, probably due south and follow it a little bit out through the uh, the northwest but as it's coming in from the southwest yeah I should start to hear probably hear some uh, VK5s if they're up it's quite early in the morning probably no VK6s and I uh, may even hear some VK4s and VK2s if I can hold it long enough maybe a ZL or two <coughs> but we'll see how we go Oh, just as a um, an experiment, I set up a uh, portable setup to see if I can get into the uh, International Space Station FM repeater. This is a six element Yagi on uh, 70 centimeters, and that's connected to a um, three element ARDF antenna. So it's quite long, a little bit heavy to operate, but uh, we'll see how we go. Now I've got in here a um, diplexer, your VHF, UHF. Lots of connectors, lots of loss in all that. And then that's um, feeding into a uh, bow fan, UV9R. Turn that on. The bow fan UV9R. It's supposed to be 8 watts out, but I checked it yesterday and it's only uh, lucky to be 5. So it's pretty much the same as the UV5R. UV9R Plus. It's also supposed to be a, quite waterproof. That was one of the main reasons I bought it for. But uh, if the, if the um, 8 watts is 5 watts, I'm not sure about the, uh, the waterproofing of it. But anyway. Um, yeah, so... Uh, and then I'll suck a camera on the... A little sport camera on the uh, boom just for a bit of fun. Probably more to pick up the audio from me as I'm calling and then you hear the stations uh, coming in. Yeah, so that's a pretty simple setup. A bit awkward to hold though, a bit heavy. Uh, probably needs to go on a tripod, but it's just a temporary thing. I can work the, uh, the station from inside, from the shack, quite comfortably, just with a vertical. So I figure... Um, I'll probably have a good go at this. I had, a, I had a go yesterday and apparently I got in, but I, I could hear everyone. But uh, getting in was a bit of a problem with only the 5 watts. But uh, yeah, I don't think uh, someone heard me, but probably not enough people heard me to call me back <laughs> and give me a contact. So we'll try it again here. I've moved location. I was up the other end of the house for that one. So here we're coming in from uh, over there, the southwest. And I'll swing around through the south. That's probably where I'll pick it up the best. It's nice and clear out there. My elevation here is uh, 124 metres above sea level. Uh, but to the south, it's about 150 metres above sea level. And to the north, it's 165 metres above sea level. So I'm down in a bit of a hollow. But once I get that south, and then it'll swing around to the south, i oh, sorry, around to the northeast, which is fairly clear over there as well. So uh, we'll see how we go. BK3, whiskey, 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 portable. BK2, WEL, BK3, whiskey, 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 portable. VK2 WEL, VK3 Whiskey, 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 5 and 9. Oh, God, thank you for the contact. Good morning to you, nice day here in Sydney. VK2 Delta, Oscar, 5 and 9. VK3 Whiskey, 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 listening. VK2 WEL, VK3 Whiskey, 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 5 and 9. 
K3, whiskey, whiskey, whiskey. Again, please, BK3, triple W. VK2 WEL, VK3 Triple W. Okay, thank you very much for that. Five and nine. Three whiskey, 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 listing. VK2 UFA, VK3 4W. VK2 USA, VK3 W Portable. VK2 USA, VK3 W. Three whiskey, whiskey, whiskey. Okay, well, I think that's about it. Oh boy, uh, this is a bit heavy to hold. <laughs> well, <clears throat> I think we made a contact. I'll have to go and look at the video later. Sorry about walking out of the range of the camera, but uh, yeah, get a bit carried away there. I think the Doppler shift worked a bit better and it looks like a um, 5 watts on the handheld with a bit of a, a directional antenna might help.